We decided to retire in Brookfield and we looked at several houses but this was the only one with a wow factor for us and we were very happy here. It was um, perfect for us, the peace and quiet, um, the space because we needed space. We both write and it was perfect for us. Family come and stay, friends come and stay. I've had wonderful parties here and workshops because I give writing workshops and um, it's been tremendous for that because people can people can always sleep over and uh, there's enough space that the house absorbs them and yeah we're never on top of each other. The wow was the Mediterranean feel. The house suits the Australian bush that it's in um, but at the same time it had um, flavours of Europe as well as Southeast Asia because of the plantings around the house. So we, um, we live a lot out on the terrace and have meals out there and the sunrise is magnificent. I find even in the hottest part of summer with fans and windows open it's delicious, you don't always need the air conditioning. And even in the evening, you know, sitting up on the hill behind the house is beautiful. Stunning views, and you see the sort of fading of the day. It's nice. On a very clear day, I think you can see the outline of Stradbroke Island. I love the mornings here, the early mornings, um, with a cup of tea on the balcony and watching the mists in the valleys. It's, very beautiful. That's in the winter and in the summer it's glorious as well. The sunsets are behind the hill but when you sit at the top of the hill looking out toward the southeast you get that closing of the day which is these beautiful soft colors that are reflected from the main sunset behind um, and again you get the, the mist and the lights coming on. I've sat up on the top of the hill with my gin and tonic until it's dark <laughs> and the lights are sparkling. It's a beautiful, beautiful.